On the 27th of September 1918, a British soldier, Henry Tandy, was in the trenches in northern France during World War I. And he was on guard duty at night. And uh, he, what he could see was a soldier walking towards his trench um, from a distance. Couldn't make out who he was, took aim, um, didn't shoot because he could have been a British soldier coming back from a combat mission or something like that. So he didn't shoot. As he got closer, the, the soldier came towards him and realised it was a, a German soldier who was wounded and also so disoriented uh, walking towards the wrong trench basically so he has a choice to make did he kill the soldier the German soldier or did he not and what happened was they sort of they apparently they froze they looked at each other no shot was taken and the other soldier you know realized what had happened nodded turned around and, and walked the other way went back to his trench this was about six weeks before the end of the war so there was some other you know, decisions being made then the thing is that soldier that was saved allegedly apparently was Adolf Hitler was also serving in the German forces at that time during World War one and the question is of course for Henry Tandy if you had a if it had taken the shot would have changed the course of history in likely a good way we don't know uh, it could have been worse of course somebody else could have come along and uh, done something even worse but the thing is in, in business and life we make decisions with short-term intention short-term knowledge we have no idea no idea at all what the long-term consequences are going to be of our actions either of doing something or not doing something so this is part of the, 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 the frustration, I guess, of life and business, is that we make a decision now that makes a lot of sense right now. For Henry Tandy, that just made sense. It was a human thing to do, the kind thing to do. End of the war, six weeks away. Let's not make it any worse. Let the guy go back and live. But the consequence of that, of course, was all the carnage that happened, you know, World War II, in a way, because the rest is, is, is history. But we don't know what the consequences are. So this is the, when you're making decisions, we have to think short term, we have to think instinctive, but we really don't know. Nobody knows what the consequences of the decisions will be in the long term. So just relax, I guess, a little bit. Don't think too much, because really, in essence, we don't know what we're doing. Short term we do, long term we have no idea. So whatever happens, it's going to be fine. But now, I thought it was an interesting story of Henry Tandy. Um, he survived the war and uh, he died, I think he was 86 years old um, in the UK as well. But uh, anyway, fabulous story. Don't worry too much. Use your instinct for short term decisions, but nobody knows what's going to happen in the long term. So just relax. Have a great week. Bye for now.